Welcome to our video about the Saab J-35 Draken, a Swedish fighter aircraft that served as the backbone of the country's air defense for several decades. In this video, we'll take a closer look at the technical details of this unique and innovative aircraft, from its design and performance to its weapons and avionics. The Saab J-35 Draken was designed in the 1950s by a team led by Eric Bratt, who sought to create a supersonic interceptor that could operate effectively in Sweden's cold and often inhospitable climate. One of the most striking features of the Draken is its double-delta wing configuration, which provides both stability and maneuverability at high speeds. The forward swept tail also helps to reduce drag and improve handling. The Draken's airframe was constructed from aluminum alloy and was designed to withstand the stresses of high-speed flight. The aircraft was powered by a single Volvo RM6B turbojet engine, which was an improved version of the Rolls-Royce Avon. The engine was equipped with an afterburner, which allowed the Draken to achieve a top speed of Mach 2 at high altitude. The Draken had a length of 15.35 meters, 50.4 feet, a wingspan of 9.42 meters, 30.9 feet, and a height of 3.89 meters, 12.8 feet. The aircraft had a maximum takeoff weight of 16,000 kilograms, 35,273 pounds, and a fuel capacity of 4,500 liters, 1,188 US gallons. The Saab J-35 Draken was equipped with a variety of weapons, including air-to-air -air missiles, rockets, and guns. The most common missile used by the Draken was the AIM-9 Sidewinder, a heat-seeking missile that could be fired from short range. The aircraft also carried a variety of rockets, including unguided rockets and the more accurate RB-24, which had a range of up to 10 miles. The Draken was also equipped with a powerful radar system, known as the PS-02A, which could track multiple targets simultaneously. The radar had a range of up to 80 miles and could be used to guide the Draken's missiles to their targets. The Draken was also equipped with an electronic warfare system, which could jam enemy radar and communication systems. The cockpit of the Saab J-35 Draken was well designed and equipped with a variety of instruments and gauges to help the pilot control the aircraft. The Draken had a modern cockpit layout for its time, with a central display and a variety of switches and controls within easy reach of the pilot. The Saab J-35 Draken entered service with the Swedish Air Force in 1960 and served as the country's primary fighter aircraft for several decades. The Draken was also exported to several other countries, including Denmark, Finland, and Austria. The Draken saw combat during the Cold War, although it was never involved in any major conflicts. The aircraft was primarily used for air defense, and its advanced radar and weapon systems made it a formidable opponent for any potential adversaries. The Saab J-35 Draken was eventually replaced by the Saab JAS-39 Gripen, a more modern and versatile fighter aircraft that entered service in the 1990s. However, the Draken remains an important part of Swedish aviation history and is still admired by aviation enthusiasts around the world. The Saab J-35 Draken was a unique and innovative fighter aircraft that served Sweden well for several decades. Its distinctive design and powerful performance made it a formidable opponent in air-to-air -air combat, while its advanced avionics and weapon systems helped to keep the country's airspace secure during the Cold War. Although it has been replaced by more modern aircraft, the Saab J-35 Draken remains an important part of aviation history and a testament to the ingenuity and innovation of the Swedish aerospace industry. Thank you for watching. 
and we hope you've enjoyed learning more about this remarkable aircraft.